Hi guys, and welcome to another INF Portal Platform overview. Um, I did say on the work before, um, I would wait comments to the second one, the work of the toy, but I'm going to do it anyways, because it is a fantastic toy. I've just found him, and I just want to do a review on him. As you saw, um, the work of the one from Anna, as you saw, that cow. The first word was the was small. This one is a giant version of him. And plus, he has all the neat guns. He has everything. He can use guns to battle. Shots. Good. Sorry about that, guys. Um, it does have the 88 um, pitch on it here. He has his gun at the top, that comes out of his front, he's got two little guns at either side, which you can um, flip and actually put them as uh, headlights. It has a cool feature of doing that. This one is the Human Alliance, the, the Human Alliance pose. I don't know how to put the, the guy, but you can flip out the door like that. And you can fit passenger inside that has proper seating for the people to sit in. Um, and they're just sitting there. It does have all his guns. He looks fantastic. He has this big massive gun at the back, which acts as in vehicle form. It's a big massive jet engine or something like that. But it looks kind of cool, I've got to admit that. He has a proper big spoiler on the back, a big black one. Um, instead of, with the small one, you saw me get the missile launchers from the um, the back of the car here. But instead, on this one, because it's the human alliance one, you've got your missile launchers at the front and the side. So you may not be able to see the problem. That does come on quite a lot, guys. You got the guns on the side, which acts as the same thing, but it is quite good. So there, you can, like I said, you can put these things around. I'll show you one side, and then you can see from the other side. So it look pretty close. One, oh, right. So you want to move down the same now. One side has a headline hand, on the other side. Have a gun. That's how good it is, guys. I first got this one. I first got this one when um, the Death of the Moon series came out, and I was able to get it. I was going to get the Jeff version, but I sort of didn't have the money at first, and now I can't get it every game. Maybe I can get it on eBay. Don't know yet for sure. Um. Yeah, it's a pretty looking cool toy. It's still all green on the top, white on the side, and it has actually grey parts in it now. So you've got its grey parts here, which actually makes it cool. But anything else, so let's transform it because it does take down a bit. It's actually transformed this guy and it's awkward. It's fun as hell to do. So, that's all I'm trying. The dog, you got to flip out like that. That's the dog. So they become the arms later on in the transformation. What you gotta do, turn it on so you can see it. Just put this part, on that. And you'll see the full section comes out like that. The bottom piece here, you wanna split that up. Check this out. So this is the scum. Oh, one of those come out. There you go. That's it. Sort of gun. And this, all you do is pull it out. So I pull it out and eventually fold it. And it will start to take form. It takes time of it to actually get into the right places. And it will click into place like that. Go to the other side. Pull it all out. As I said, it does take time of it to click in. But when you've done it, it looks cool. 
like so, like that. And then what you do is these that folds in, do it to the other side, folds in like that. And this piece actually folds in towards oh you just got mixed round out with that piece and then that goes at like that. So I'm quickly gonna do this piece real quick. So that needs to be only every two seconds to go on both sides because we should know. Like so. There you go. Right, so sort of like so and then you gotta rotate it round. You rotate it round the little parts will start going into farmer and they will go down properly then. Like that. So the knee punch got a twist on. And then again with the other part. So your feet should actually walk like that. When you've fully done it, the feet are like that. With this top piece, you can move the guns out the way. Put them back a bit. You pull it out. You can do the first, pull out. Because you need all the space you can get on these ones. Pull these guns out a bit. There we go. Left feet first. If you take the top, push it down, and then push a piece in the center. Like right that. It's gone. Comes out of the top. And you can just twist that around for now. We don't need that. Not yet. And then the full section should fold down like that. And then here's a little clip. I can see it. There's a little clip here. And then there's a little tab here. And all you do is you push it in. Pull it in there. Click in. It takes a few attempts. I'll just turn it on so I can do it. Just click and go power. There we go. It's hooked in now. That's what it should look like. It's hooked in now. And then what you do, lift these parts up. That one up. For this, you got to have the lights out. Because that's what it looks like when you're in cam mode. You need the lights. Um, roll up the phone, sorry. And these parts, you lift up. Like that. And turn it like that. Just like that. You do the same thing, lift up and move it across like that. Now these parts push it like that. Then these fall down. So you guys if you can't see this, I will show you properly. There you go. So you should have a car looking like that. Which looks awesome, guys. It actually does. But you do get this piece falling down quite a lot. I do not know why it does that, but it does. And then the next part, pull that down, and lift the head out. You just gotta pull it out. And then that goes back in, and then the head just should stick together. But it's not like me. There we go. So it should cut like that and the head will go. After you've done that you can move all its legs down. Make it actually like, stand or looking like you want to stand. So you're getting like there. Look how cool this is getting man. And it's only gonna get a lot better than this. Alright. So we've got this up to now. Yep. Alright, oh, it's coming out again guys. Told you, if you don't keep up with it, it will keep coming out. Alright, next part is to do the, the arms. What you do with the arms? You're going to have to rotate this around. Like so. And then these parts. Uh, I remember how I did this before. Yeah. You lift these parts up. You twist this top. And it will click into place. So it goes over the arm. 
فوق الساون شو هو المسار إذا هو أعلى مسارية فوق الساون أو لا فوق أو كيا لا كيا one second sorry about this guys you can say two transformers two four pieces of sound two one two and that's a pick up from the transformers thing so you should have it all in one hand and make that just right you fold that into the actual transformers so you should get an arm like that which looks awesome and you can bend it to the other side Sorry about this guys, and may be an oil if you have to do some more work with the first because I'm sorry it is a pain in the ass. And I wanted to get into them today. I don't have people I don't have people always asking how did this how did why have you done this, why haven't you done that? So that's how it looks. You're looking fantastic at the moment. Um, next piece, oh, you can take this off, you've got to tell you guys, when you've been careful on, he has a blade, you kill him, kill people with it, it's funny as hell. You hold everything the same way you did with the other one, and then you fold that on. So it's got two. Mm, I'm sure I don't know. Ah, well. Sorry about the size. Um, it's going to have to be just all the time, actually. There you go. Well, it looks like Lord Buster transformed. And I can show you a um, comparison. Lord Buster. One second. His head's barking. You see? Small version. It's only his first one. Well, it's a fantastic looking toy. Um, you can. Have this gun for your icon. No, see, you don't like that. So it's like that. Big gun. And then it's so. You can plug in the top of them. So you can have him a blade master. So it's like that. He's a big machete. And on the other side, like I said, with the gun. And I'll put the gun for one and I'll find it. Sorry guys, I've put the gun somewhere, so I'll just put him down. I'll just drop the gun. He will fall over. There we go. Oh, he's fall over on the keypad. Oh guys, I've put the gun somewhere, and now I've found where I've put it. Which is awesome. Oh, there we go. I found it. He's gone. Put it into the room. There we go. And that is Lord Buster all done up. It's far from doing it. His back has a miniature gun, which you kind of have out. It's for the human line partners to actually sit on. What you do with that is you flip it up, turn it around, and move it like that. And then the little part at the top. So, you guys can sit there, and he's got a little gun. Open the old box. That. Which is quite awesome. Quite awesome indeed. I like the toy. You've got a lot of movement in this one. But he's a brilliant toy. Yeah, I'd rather just to get him. I'm sorry about this video if it's been a long video. It has um, been bad, but thank you very much. This is an Iron Ad 45 more video. I thought to give you some more videos coming out. Sorry about the film. Cheers.